Hey guys, welcome to Cora Radar, your one-stop shop for tips and tricks in the digital world. Today we'll talk about how to factory reset iPhone without Apple ID password. Can't remember the Apple ID password or don't have access to the Apple ID but still want to reset your iPhone to its factory settings? You've come to the right place. Maybe you're selling, donating or giving away an old iPhone but don't have an Apple ID to erase info. Perhaps you've just forgotten the Apple ID password soon after changing it recently. Or you're just performing a factory reset to troubleshoot a phone issue which requires an Apple ID password you no longer have access to. Whatever the reason, this video can save you out. Now, follow me to go through some workable solutions you can try to factory reset iPhone without password. Don't worry if you're a novice of digital devices or a new iPhone user. We'll introduce all the methods to restore iPhone to its factory settings even when you don't know or have the Apple ID password. They work for all iPhone models running from older iOS versions like iOS 12 to later iOS versions like iOS 18. Besides, if you have any questions, write it down in the comment below and we'll reply to you within 24 hours. Restore iPhone to factory settings in recovery mode. Many users are confused about whether they're able to erase iPhone without the Apple ID password. In fact, each iPhone has an restore option built into its operating system that lets users force an iPhone to factory reset using a computer. This doesn't require your Apple ID or previous owner's Apple ID to activate if it's a second-hand phone. We'll show you the detailed steps below. Before we start, note that factory resetting your device will erase all files, apps, and settings from your phone and they won't come back unless you have backups. Alright, first of all, download the specific tool on the computer. If your computer is running with Windows or Mac OS 10.14 or earlier, install and open Apple Devices app and iTunes. If your computer is running with Mac OS Catalina 10.15 or later, install and run Apple Devices app and Finder. Use the official to connect your iPhone you want to factory reset without Apple ID password to the machine. Next, press specific buttons to get iPhone into recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and later models, press and quickly release the volume up button. Then press and quickly release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side button until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the volume down button and the side button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 6s and earlier models, press and hold the home button and the side or top button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. During the process, iPhone display will show a black screen, pop up an Apple logo, and then switch to a screen with a link, laptop, and cord. The whole process may take around 20 seconds. Feel free to try again if you fail once. Once entered, it's time to make some actions on the computer while keeping your iPhone connected. Take a look if there is an opening dialog box with restore and update two given options. If it doesn't appear, locate your iPhone's name or icon and tap it. If it's already there, move the mouse cursor to click the restore option. Click restore and update. Click Next and select Agree. The program will then begin the restore process to erase an iPhone without Apple ID. The factory reset process might take at least one hour to finish as it requires downloading and installing a firmware file around 5 GB. Your iPhone will restart and load the Hello screen once the restore is over. Now, disconnect your iPhone from the computer and set it up to do anything you want. Change Apple ID password then reset your iPhone. You remember the Apple ID account but forgot the password so you can't reset iPhone to its factory settings? Then, try to reset the password on Apple's official website. Prepare the details of email address or phone number that's registered to your Apple ID in advance. Then, the whole process of doing an iPhone factory reset without Apple ID is pretty straightforward. We'll show you the detailed steps below. Visit the website https colon slash slash iforgot.apple.com slash. Choose the reset password option. In the required field, type the email address or the phone number that's associated with your iPhone's Apple ID account. Enter the characters shown in the image to proceed. Enter the email address or phone number that's registered to your Apple ID. If everything goes well, there will be a message sent to your devices that have linked to the same Apple ID account. On that device, tap Allow to confirm to reset the Apple ID password. Once done, just head to the Settings app and bring your iPhone to its factory settings using the newly changed Apple ID password. Erase iPhone without Apple ID in Settings app. Do you have access to the iPhone inside which has already set up with an existing Apple ID? 
If so, you can factory reset iPhone without an Apple ID in the settings app. During the reset process, it allows you to enter the lock screen passcode to verify if you're the owner of the iPhone. We'll show you the detailed steps below to erase iPhone without Apple ID password. Enter the lock screen passcode to unlock your iPhone. Go to the settings app. Scroll down and tap general. Scroll all the way down and choose transfer or reset iPhone. Select erase all content and settings. Tap continue to go on. When asked, type the lock screen passcode to verify your identity. If the code is correct, it'll start erasing your iPhone without Apple ID password. Turn to Apple support to factory reset an iPhone without an Apple ID. If you've tried all you can do but to no avail, try requesting additional support at Apple's website or go to the brick and mortar store. They can help delete the old Apple ID account, and after that, you can create a new one without restrictions. Before attempting, make sure you're clear about the requirements or in advance. First, it needs proof of ownership documentation like your iPhone serial number, IMEI or MEID. Second, your iPhone has been set to lost mode. Third, you can't restore data from the backup you've made previously that's connected to the Apple ID you don't remember. Fourth, they don't offer assistance on an iPhone owned by a business or educational institution. Once you're ready, use the link in the description below to reset iPhone without Apple ID password. And there you have it, folks. We've reached the end of our video on how to factory reset an iPhone without an Apple ID password. Thank you for watching, and we wish you the best of luck in restoring the service to use the device as normal. If you did, please consider liking and buying this video a super thanks. Your support means a lot to us to deliver more tech-related content. Until next time.